All right, everybody, here we are, day three. Corey's gonna lead us from here where we are to the pumpkin patch. And then maybe we'll go over here and then go up there and get groceries. Maybe. <laughs> maybe, we'll see. Maybe. What's around this corner, I wonder? Oh, it's just a log. Whoa, whoa, whoa. See, I didn't want the bike to follow me. I'm down. Buddy Corey up ahead from Tamil Adventure Products. He's turned out to be a great riding partner. What fun! So today we're going to be exploring a little bit of the OHV park, hitting a town, buying some groceries, and then I'll come back and stay here another night. Corey's off to meet with a buddy somewhere else. I'll be solo again. That's all right. He will be missed. looking around here so in this particular park you can drive anywhere yes there are trails but you are allowed to drive off the trail make your own trail not far from here there's a BLM area Bureau of Land Management where you can drive but you have to stay on the trails we got plenty of riding out here photo shoot time Corey adjusted my clutch. I've got a camel. I'll call it the camel clutch. The light pole. He noticed that it wasn't installed quite properly. So we adjusted it. And it feels great. Uh oh. Soft. And apparently this uh, 790 has a very fickle clutch that's easy to fry out. So I gotta be careful. Yeah. What you doing? Oh, look at that. Wow. Good thing you noticed it. Well, while Corey's fixing his junk, down here is what he adjusted. This thing was too close to the tank, so it's making my clutch kind of ride a bit. He fixed it, it's all better. Uh-huh. Uh-oh. That obviously got loose and hooked up in the tire. We're having our share of incidents. I was like, how is that loose already? That's crazy. Problems losing stuff. I'm sure my <laughs> I'm sure my tails came loose and got hooked in the tire and ripped off. Oh, there it is. Is it? <laughs> yep. Oh dear. Quite like this. 
when I saw footage of this, you could tell me it was like in Iraq or Iran or Afghanistan. I believe you. It's in California. <laughs> Look at Corey up there, having fun. Try this. Nice. Wow. Holy. Your core. Don't forget to smile. Crap on a side by side down there. Wow. The pumpkin patch. You believe we found it. Here we are at the patch of pumpkins. Did you like? Do you like the walk? You must be able to fit through this window in order to come in. It's a good thing we didn't have to grease it up for you to get through. Pause if you want to read this. Huh. this. All right, cool. Give me a minute to read it and we'll hit the road. Oh, part two in the Chronicles of the Genius of Corey. He's gonna like that, hey? These things were popping off and he said, why don't you just put a zap strap around it? And and they won't. They're holding up perfectly now. There's no way that's coming out. And it would have really sucked if this is kind of flopping around out here. Or worse yet, once we're on the BDR. Thanks, Corey. So I told you how to fix your junk, and mine's falling off now. So. I'm going to be of no help to you. <laughs> Consulting the map. All right, pumpkin patch. We are here. Yeah. So if we take that wash, that wash to crossover trail mm -hmm. crossover trail goes right to 22 nice and then maybe when we come back we can go see the the boiling mud oh yeah yeah for sure go for a dip Until you're on it. Especially with a little dust hanging in the air. It's just like, I don't know, am I freaking out or is it going to be nice and super grippy? A 
exactly kicking ass, am I? I'm letting this bike ride me. of videos of this trip as well all from his perspective they're probably going to be a little while before they come out i'm uh i've already edited the stuff we rode yesterday and the previous day uh cory's busy out here running his business from his van communicating with staff and customers all that stuff so he edits his video in the cooler months of january february so you guys will have that to look forward to then you can see how he rode that bike from his perspective, which I'm sure is going to be cool. It's so cool in here. Can you imagine this at night? Oh, I can imagine it better on my 500 at night. This would be amazing at night. Like, look at that shit up there. Yeah, I like it a lot. Oh, she's a little chunky in here. is way harder to ride in the sand than my 500 for sure but it's not about what's best but what you want to ride take it there and have fun and conquer maybe be a little challenged i'm gonna sleep well tonight those little leg punches that I've had to do about 10 of them so far since we've been in this wash. They make all the difference. Just a little bop and we're upright again. There was one. Yeah! That's nice. It's done. <laughs> Lots of dabbing. Yep. Yeah, I hope you guys can see that. It's a gas dome trail. That way. Oh, that's probably it right there. A bunch of people up there. Let's go check it out. <laughs> that little squeak. Nice. We are here. Oh, folks, there it is. <laughs> <laughs> For scale. Oh, it bubbled. Did you see that? Yeah. Bubbling. Well, hey. It's something. It's not something. Sure, not sure what it is. Cameras on cameras. Cameras on cameras. Okay, that was fun. Let's go look over here. Was that the whole thing? 
Alright, we're headed back. I looked down at my dash there. My fuel light's blinking. I'm almost out of fuel. That's a bummer. <laughs> so hopefully I make it. Should have filled up in town. I don't know what I was thinking. Oh dear. So, I should warn you. I have blinky fuel light. Oh, do you? Blinky, blinky. Okay. Please take us back the most direct route. <laughs> so, power along the road to... Oh shit, this goes right back to the highway. The one oh, on? Yeah. That's straight to the highway. Okay. Let's do that and then... And we're oh. not very far. We're right here. And the highway's right there. Okay. And if I'm running out the highway, no big deal. Hey, we made it! Right on! Good old home sweet home. Here it is. There's home. Awesome. Ta-da! That's it for today's ride. Thanks for coming along. Hope to see you again tomorrow. Ta-da!